So you don't have time to consume an entire podcast. That's okay. Enjoy the highlights on TRS Clips. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell icon. The first question is: Is guru and master the same thing when you're referring to master? And the second question, obviously, we have to talk about Mahavatar Baba Ji because he's a part of YSS as well. The book has so much written about Baba Ji, mm-hmm. and uh, generally, I think a lot of Indians are getting to know about the legend of Mahavatar Baba Ji. Yes, yes, yes. So. Now I will let you uh, yeah. answer that question. I would love to know it from your eyes and mind, yes, sir. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, see, uh, you may have many mentors. You know the way now. Suppose we are doing this shoot, and we are covering some you know topic, spiritual topic. So this is you. This is one aspect of your personality or your work that I want to do this work. You know, I want people to know about what's happening all over the world in India, maybe. And then uh, since this is a professional aspect. you are enjoying doing it so you need someone who knows about this subject someone who has done this earlier or someone who is expert in this without that person it's difficult to do you can still experiment you can still you know practically you know do your activities and all that but when you have someone who knows about this subject in and out that gives you boost that gives you better you know position and then you start growing so this person can be called as a mentor or a teacher also so sant kabir or sant gyaneshwar these are sadgurus when you talk about uh, sai baba or even uh, there are many in the you know ramakrishna paramhans so these are sadgurus and the moksha guru or param guru is like mahavatar baba ji or his guru agastya muni so they are there to give you moksha and mukti so you don't need to follow them all the time go pray ask and then they'll just give it that's how simple it is so you may have many masters not an issue with that don't get confused with it gurus but sadguru is always one param guru is one for this entire planet itself at any period of time that there is one or two maximum a god uh, you can call it as god that's what i just told you know god don't identify as someone as one single person it's a consciousness it's a consciousness so you can see baba ji as god he doesn't see himself as god he sees himself as servant sevak and he enjoys being that 